Hey, Christ Church Albany, and hope your summer is going well. Uh, so we've been gathering together in our community groups uh, to go through the series of unanswered prayer. And so I think we're about three weeks in, and I hope that is going well for folks and they're able to really uh, hear uh, kind of what's coming out of that and maybe where God's speaking uh, to them individually. I encourage folks that have not been able to find a community group to get engaged um, through maybe following up uh, with us online and we would love to connect you with, so hopefully, a community group that would work best for you um, from a scheduling perspective. And you can get involved there and uh, join us as we work through this series this summer. Uh, this week is a unique week, though. Uh, this week, we are not going to gather in community groups and go through uh, the Unanswered Prayer Series. This week, we're going to be gathering together, all of us, uh, on July 31st, this Sunday, at the First Lutherans. Uh, we'll be meeting around 7 o'clock p.m., and we'll be gathering together for a campfire worship. This night's going to be a wonderful opportunity where we are able to spend some time around campfires, enjoying maybe some s'mores, uh, but more importantly, spending some time together, uh, gathering, sharing stories about the summer, and really maybe talking about some of the things that God's really revealing to us through this whole series or through other circumstances. Um, but more importantly, I think it's going to be a time where we are able to gather uh, not only together, but with God. And we're able to spend some time in song, uh, worshiping God and all the incredible things uh, that he has provided for us. Um, the whole event should last maybe about an hour and a half. And so we encourage folks to bring your chairs, picnics, um, and come join us for a wonderful summer evening together. Additionally, as we have talked uh, so often uh, at church um, and with Christ Church in Albany, that we strive to be a generous people, uh, generous beyond reason. And so we really encourage folks to really find three ways uh, to be generous. First is maybe find a local cause, a local charity that you can support with your time, talents, and, and financially. Next would be set aside some financial uh, means for hosting, for being hospitable, um, and sharing meals with others. Uh, this is a wonderful way to bless others around you, but also uh, have just incredible conversations. Um, and lastly would be to support the local church. Um, and so Christ Church Albany is an independent church. So everything we do this summer and throughout the year, it is uh, running solely because of your generous donations. And so if that is something you feel called uh, to support, we encourage you to do that. And you can do that through... Um, the website online. Um, and even as a church, we strive to be generous beyond means. Um, and so we always talk about our equipment uh, and things we have. We, we love to lend that out and to use that as a means of helping others. But we also even take some of our financial means and we support other organizations and missions around us. And so tonight we actually have a wonderful opportunity where we can hear about some of that mission work that is occurring um, and, and is being supported uh, by Christchurch Albany. And so uh, I encourage you to spend this time hearing a little bit about Joy and Karim and the work they're doing in the Turkish community. I know some of us might have heard a little bit earlier this year about some of the incredible work, but I hope uh, they're going to be providing some updates on just the story God's writing in their lives and the work he is doing through them. And so I encourage you uh, to listen in and hear about that wonderful update. Um, and then lastly, I hope to see you. Hope to see you this Sunday. Hope to see you around a campfire and we are able to catch up and spend some time worshiping with God. So again, this Sunday, July 31st, 7 o'clock. Hope to see you there. Thank you all so much for your prayers for us. We really appreciate it. We are excited to give you this update about what God has been doing. Mm -hmm. uh, things have been going really well here in New Jersey. The team here has learned a lot. The social media uh, advertisements are up and running, and that program is going well. Karen will share a little bit more about that. And uh, people have been baptized, have come to faith, and we're just really excited about what's happening here. Yeah. Ee, Gürcistan'daki e, Türkiye'de ve Azerbaycan'da sosyal medya reklamlarımız başladı. 
Uh, our social media advertisements have started in Georgia, in Turkey, and here in the United States. Ve şu anda yeni videolar çekiliyor. Artık İstanbul'da ve Azerbaycan'da video stüdyolarımız var. And now there are new videos being taken of Turkish people's uh, testimonies. We have a studio now in Azerbaijan and in Istanbul. Mm -hmm. Ve gider gitmez hemen muhtemelen Azerbaycan'a gideceğiz. Oradaki takımla, e, kontakları takip eden kişilere eğitim vermek için. And as soon as we move, get to Georgia, uh, we'll be going to, to Azerbaijan to follow up with the people who are following up with these social media contacts. Ve aynı zamanda Türkiye'ye, e, Türkiye'deki kontakları takip edecek kişilerle şu anda görüşüyoruz, onlara eğitim vermek için. And right now we are meeting with people following up with the contacts from Turkey and uh, giving them training for this. E, ve şimdi inanılmaz büyük bir dönüş oluyor. Her gün İncil isteyenler, e, yorum yapanlar, direkt WhatsApp üzerinden iletişime geçenler. And now there's an unbelievable response from people uh, requesting Bibles every day and writing comments. People, we have many people to follow up on. Ve tabii ki bu en büyük e, mimarı sizin dualarınız. And of course the biggest contribution is your prayers. Yes, and uh, when you watch this video, we will be in Georgia. Right now we're in New Jersey, but at the end of this month in June, we're moving to Georgia. Uh, God has provided a place for us to stay. He's provided over 60% of our funding budget. And uh, it's possible now for us to move. And so we're very excited that we'll be in Georgia when you see this video. And we'll be right in the middle of a one-month training program. This training program is for uh, students from Azerbaijan and Turkey who want to learn how to evangelize better and uh, how to get along with each other. The program will focus on a good relationship with God, good relationship with teammates, uh, learning how to evangelize. And there will be some classroom instruction, but a lot of the uh, time will be out on the streets doing actual ministry, practicing, working together. So there will be street ministry. There'll be visits to villages, uh, Turkish speaking villages in Georgia. There'll be visits to Turkey and, uh, we're just really excited about all of that. Why is there this one month program? The one month program is mostly for us actually, to be able to understand how to better prepare for starting a school because we want to do a six month program like this for uh, students from Turkey and Azerbaijan and other Turkish speaking places so that they can come and be trained in evangelism and discipling people. And uh, so we're very excited about this vision because as they move to places that have no churches and uh, disciple people, churches will be planted. So it's our vision to see a church planted in every Turkish neighborhood and city around the world. We can use your prayers with all of this. It's a big dream. Uh, but first of all, we'd ask your prayers for us as we transition into Georgia, especially for our children, that they will have a good time, that they will be happy. And uh, we ask your prayers for the one month program in July that things will go smoothly. Uh, we'd also like to ask your prayers as we are preparing to start this school, that it would um, go well and that God would just give us a lot of wisdom as we set it all up. Thank you so much. We really appreciate you. We appreciate your partnership. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hi, we're the Sebastian Goulair family. My name is Stefna. This is Joy. This is Karam. This is David. This is Mercy. Thank you for listening. Okay.